just for the last minute planners. We use Google Flights and Gas Buddy's Gas Trip Calculator to break down the cost benefit of driving versus flying to three nearby destinations, Los Angeles, Phoenix and Salt Lake City. Up first, Los Angeles. The flight is about an hour each way, and the cheapest flights we found were $117 per person round trip. You may not save all that much by driving. It should cost you between $50 and $130 in gas to get to and from LA. But you have to be willing to spend a total of eight or nine hours in the car on I-15, maybe more with traffic. For some though, that just means more quality time with the family. Sitting in the car with the whole family and you know, driving, stopping and beautiful places like here, um, it kind of keeps you together. AAA predicts Phoenix will be the fourth most popular travel destination this Thanksgiving. Flights to Phoenix, though, are significantly more expensive, averaging between $255 and $400 per person round trip. You could save hundreds of dollars by driving. The drive along US 93 should take you between 9 and 10 hours total. And again, gas should cost between $50 and $130 to fill up the tank twice which is more expensive than in past years. We'd like the prices to be lower. We'd like the government to, you know, to take some actions to lower the gas prices because we're suffering. Finally, Salt Lake City. Thanksgiving flights from Las Vegas to Salt Lake are averaging between $300 and $360 per person round trip. Once again, the road trip route is more affordable. The drive along I-15 to Salt Lake City takes about six hours each way without stopping or 12 hours total and gas should cost you $80 to $180. The longer drive means you might have to fill up a third time, but drivers say it is still more affordable than flying. I didn't really have a choice because my mom couldn't afford to fly me and my girlfriend because since COVID, everyone's buying flights now. So. Ah, the struggle is real. Well, if you're wondering why the discrepancy in gas prices is so large, it's because it's really based on a lot of factors, including the year of your vehicle, the make and model, its fuel efficiency, where you get your gas, and also the type of gas you buy. But Gas Buddy's gas trip calculator factors all of that in and then recommends the cheapest places to refuel along your route. We're going to put up that link on our website along with this story for you at KTNV.com. Live in the studio, Ross DiMatteo, 13 Action News.